And here comes our first boat of the day down here at Black Point. Our crew's getting a little crooked early. Tosses the line and misses. I guess, oh no! He went for the second toss and he went down, but he got lucky he got caught on the swim deck. I thought for sure we were gonna have a swimmer down here. And Black Point's one of those spots that you really don't want to wind up in the water. Welcome back, crew, to the greatest show on earth, though, and that is the Miami Boat Ramps channel. I'm your host, Broncos Guru, and today we are down here, as we mentioned, at Black Point Marina. We're gonna watch some boats come in and see what happens. Now, I always get a little nervous about this one. The vessel we see in front of us here are guys standing in the bow as they're coming in. You just can't get good balance up there. If Cap decides he's gonna brake check heavy on you, you're going over the front. But Cap's got the slow roll approach going in. A lot of turning of the wheel right here. It typically, once you got a multi-engine boat, we don't see a lot of that. Usually you just want to keep those engines straight and use the throttles to kind of get yourself in. So looks like he's going to kick the stern around a little bit, trying to get the bow in. Our guy, I mean, he's close, but I'm not sure why he didn't jump off there. If it was close enough to just hand the line off, I probably would have jumped off. But Cap's backing up. And there's a boat behind him they gotta watch out for. Our guy in the bow is kinda looking now. Oh, he almost slipped there too. And he's gonna take the line back from the guy off the dock. So Cap's gonna back out on this one and we're gonna try and set this up one more time. Here we go, he's backing out. Gonna come forward at it, one more shot. gonna back up so attempt number two is not gonna get it done either and one of the things that we always look out for something like this when I start seeing somebody who's turning the engines a ton on these multi-engine boats the camera guys know we got to look out for them because if they're doing that oh he's coming in hot now Stern's gonna hit the dock he jumps off to try and push it but no they're gonna wind up getting the dock smack in again he just turned the motors for the dock too much torque with all three of them going in reverse, and it winds up smacking the dock. But the good news for them is they are on the dock, which is uh, better than where they were at. So our crew's coming in, slow roll approach as Cap approaches the dock. Not a bad angle, good speed. And we can hear somebody spinning tires in the background. He's going to tuck it in nice and close, and that's going to work for him. And now scramble mode's in effect. They slid off the dock, so they did great docking, and now all of a sudden you can see Wifey running around trying to get lines together as the vessels come off. So there we go. She moves the line back toward the stern so they can get the stern of the boat pulled back over. But, man, that was like full-on panic right there. She started freaking out a little bit. as She was left on the boat, cap left, and... Fortunately, this young lady here in the green is going to pull her over and she's going to be good to go. And here comes our next crew on approach for the dock. We've got somebody in the bow on the ready with the line, so. We're partially ready to roll on this one. And they're going to roll in on a dock that somebody's backing down. So Cap gets it a little sideways, trying to get it over. Gets it pretty close to level back out. And here comes somebody down from the truck like, bro, what are you doing? We're backing in. Man, that was actually a good toss. He hooked that one from a pretty good distance around the pole and they get it pulled over. So our guy who's backing the boat down is kind of going around him. And he scrambles over to try and get the stern of the boat back up. So the guy who's backing down is gonna bring it back closer into the dock. He 
he gonna come back down on them? It looks like it. They're actually gonna move back. So just so you guys know, this is the courtesy part of this. So if you guys are going down there and it's a long dock like this and you're coming in and somebody's already coming down the ramp, do exactly like this. You're gonna wanna stay as far back on that dock as you can and let the other crew come in. Good job, we don't see this very often. Typically down here, this is where fights start to break out. So Cap's trying to get his set up. We've got Wifey in the bow, a young lady on the stern. So we got two lines on the ready. He's just gotta get them close and they'll get them on. But he's been struggling. This is attempt three actually of him trying to get this on. So Wifey puts a foot over the bow rail and it looks like, I can't tell she's not gonna go for it though. No, nope, she's gonna come back over. So Cap left the helm for some reason also. And he's coming and he's trying to get that bow around, but he's kicking the stern out so far that they're not going to get a good angle on it. And it looks like he's going to have to back out and try this one one more time. And Mama's starting to dance up front. She might not want to do that. Captain looks like he's distracted enough already. we got to keep him on point. So here we go, going back into gear. Oh, he kind of gooses it a little bit. Everybody has to hang on. But now he's coming in a little hot, and he's going to have the same issue again as his stern is just going to kick out. And he's basically sideways on the dock. But nobody's really going for it either. I mean, we probably could have gotten something around the pole on that last one. They appeared to be close enough to the dock on it. And here we go. One more try. Let's see if they can get it put up this time. So coming back in on the dock, nice smooth approach this time. But again, coming in really bow heavy, and unless somebody's gonna go for it off the bow, you're not really gonna get anywhere. So there we go, she goes for an attempt on the pull, but I think she lost the line. Nope, there we go. And now she's lost the line. Somebody's gonna run over and grab it for her. And our girl on the stern's got it, and they're gonna be good to go from here. And speaking of good to go, we're gonna get out of here as well. Thanks for watching, crew. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Miami Boat Ramps. If you did, please check out our other content. We have Wavy Boats, who does a bunch of great things down at the inlets. My channel, Broncos Guru, do some great comedy boating videos there as well. And of course, we've got Boats vs. Hallover, where Man and Machine take on Mother Nature down at Hallover Inlet. And if you guys haven't already, go ahead and drop an anchor on the subscribe button here.